Hello everybody, Joe Bag Donuts here, and welcome back for another episode of Muv Love Alternative, the anime, the shit show, the fire. Uh, I am extremely tired. Sorry this is coming up, uh, being uploaded a little late. It's like two days past the original uh, episode air date. I've been getting fucking shit on at work with this new, uh, this new work schedule. I'm the only guy on shift, uh, 12 hour shifts. Probably uh, not including tonight that I work, because tonight, tonight wasn't that bad, but the last two days. Uh, out of the past 48 hours, those two days, I'd say about 20, 21 of them, I was out on the line working a jet. Fuck that. Ugh. Ugh. I feel bad for the guy I had to drag along with me, because it wasn't even his component, but it's a two-man job, so he just drew the short end of the stick. But enough about me bitching about my life. Let's uh let's see Takaru bitch about his life, which isn't that bad right now, honestly. You know, uh, besides the impending doom of humanity and the inevitable end of the Alternative Four program and his like training that he has omnipotent like future sight of, uh, yeah. Well, fuck, man, where did we even leave off last time? So, yeah, la yesterday was the Thomas Dad episode. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, he fucking mysterious shadowy figure in the office. Uh, I'm also using a new uh, a new sub. Ooh, changing it up. Third time's the charm, as I say. Uh, the version I'm using is Read VN. Uh, one, because it, uh, it aligns with my uh, personal preference of read the goddamn visual novel, you casuals. And uh, two, it includes subs for the OP and the ED. And is my PC... Ah, uh, my PC's starting to stutter again. I thought I'd fix that. Fucking, uh, I updated a driver. Uh, updates, whatever. Whatever, fuck it, we'll do it live. YouTube, you know how it is. Three, two, one, go. If you're using a, uh, like, uh, subs please or a rye raw, those include, like, the little, the little title card of, like, I don't even know what you know the, the the dude who looks like Hank Hill on the front. It includes that. This this is just going right into the episode. So if you're using either of those versions or the site you're streaming on uses those, you know, just go past there. Black screen right before animation actually starts. So three, two, one, go. We know how to do this. You good? You good? All right. And three, two, one. What's a mysterious man of mystery? This whole anime is a joke. This man, he knows everything. Guy with a nice hat. He's a fucking spook! Never, never trust any three-letter agency. And that's coming to you from a, from a fellow Fed. Never, never trust them. And those guys had, they had like their own little fucking, yes, yes, hello, hello, chief. They had their own little fucking, little, little area where they're running shit in Kabul when I was fucking doing flights out of Afghanistan a fucking couple months ago. Ah, uh, see, ah, uh, it's doing it. There we go. I just gotta have one hand on my mouse just doing loops on my second screen to keep it from doing that. Yeah, I'll, I'll reset my PC after this. I can I can actually read the subs to find out what the fuck what the fuck they're talking about this OP. <laughs> yeah, despair and induced flashbacks. Just just vibing, bro. Like, like I said, Opie's growing on me. I, I, I like it. But still, still the, the edit 
the edits some guy did on A in like three hours with the uh, with the original VNOP. Still pretty fire. But you got you to love the anime OPs where they literally spell out the plot of the show to you. Because, you know, subtlety is uh, not a trait that a lot of Japanese media has. Yeah, good old Hikoto. Which is weird that you don't know him, considering Makoto was like your your only guy friend uh, in in the other world. He also kidnaps you in one end of the uh, the visual novel. Not quite not quite a bad end, but if you don't secure enough points to. Uh, like securely land on any girl's route and you try to like go on the Tama route, which uh, is like there's the Maya and uh, and Sumika route. Oh, oh, XG. Mm. X is generally used for uh, test aircraft. That's that designation. But as I was saying, there's the there's the Sumika and Maya route, and then there's the kind of uh, class rep and Ayamine won, and then Tama's whoosh goes off on a tangent doing its own thing. Fuck you, Sigiri. I see you there. Fucking shitty ass pink suit from the day after. But yeah, if if you if you don't get any girl's route, you get fucking kidnapped by Makoto's dad and stuck on a tuna fishing boat with Makoto and just have to survive. Alternative? Is that a title drop? Yeah, it's a it's a little it's a little uh don't come to school tomorrow kinda. Dead man walking. What does uh, the man in question have to say for himself for being uh, alive when he is supposed to be super dead in, in this timeline? God, that's that's one of the benefits of getting older. You can be a fucking tuny as fuck as you want, but if you got the experience to back it up, you know, no one can stop you. Yeah. Hey, the the amusement park date. Man, all I can think about the amusement park date from Extra is if if you if Maya goes on it, her outfit, like, god damn. It's like this weird, almost like leather dress dominatrix looking thing. Whew. Well, no. Easy enough. Is that an oscilloscope? Fucking looks like one. Theoretically, I know how to use one. Uh, <laughs> in practice, uh, ooh. <gasps> it's 
Sumika. Cool. Weird. But like, what about his soul, man? How do you, how does science measure the soul? Yep. A whole, if a tree falls in a forest, no one's around to, you know, see it or hear it, doesn't make a sound. With with the fact that other people are observing him as Shirogane Takaru, therefore, he exists in this world as Shirogane Takaru, i.e., the logic of reality can't reject him, but if... If no one can recognize him anymore, does he really exist? Deep philosophical quandaries. Yeah, man, you gotta do the plot. We're only like a third of the way through, after all. Well, maybe like a quarter. Oh, fuck, my jaw just popped. Ah. Yeah! We're getting the best start. God damn, Yuko, you got a fucking dumpy. Yeah, that's kind of a weird shot of her, too. Her tits look funny. Yuko Sensei is supposed to be like ba boom ba boom, but not but not like super super that, but like, you know she she's got it going on. Don't make it too weird, bud. She's like thirteen. Yeah, you're attached to the hip now. Yeah, the thing with that is there's an extra, there's a Sumika feeding Takaru CG. And what it was in the visual novel was essentially that same pose, but with uh, with Kazumi over it. So it, it was supposed to be a little more, oh yeah, remember? <laughs> I mean, I... Ah, my dude can't catch a break. Now you did your best. Oh, come on. That, that can't be up. That can't be all they showed of it. That was like a whole like two hour section of budding around with Cosme all day. Cool. Yeah, man, totally. It just may also cease to exist. Yes. You'll no longer be, like, pinned to this reality. You'll just be, you know, moving along with it. Instead of being firmly attached. 
So you need someone around to really be your, your anchor point. What a, what a big dramatic moment. Damn, he's fucking charging up his shields in Halo 2, playing the tutorial. It's the moment! Yeah, they did it! Everyone said they, they wouldn't, but they did it. It's, it's like the Final Fantasy VII remake where everyone's like, no, man, they're not going to do Hell House. Hell House is too weird. But but the very important CG of Extra, of walking in, Sumika in the bathroom. <gasps> say it. Say the line. Say the line. No! It, it was a drill milky punch. But it wasn't. You got a shit clocked. Yeah, you're more of just along for the ride for that world's Takaru. No, the bunny. The one saving grace of the show. Why are you breathing like that? That's not how labored breathing works. As did the person that draw that like never see another human being? You know, that, that's one of the weird things about, like, art and animation is, well, one of the hard things about it is, like, just with drawing people, like, because we are human ourselves, seeing seeing something that looks a little off, super easy, super easy to, to catch that. If, if you're looking at, like, a drawing or animation of a person, be like, I just like, mm, like, the anatomy looks a little off. You can't really say what it is, but. You, you just know that you know because you know, you know? Do or do not, there is no try. We are really fucking going fast here. Like, I'm, it's, it's been like a couple months since I played the VN, but I'm pretty sure there was like, like that day and a half that passed by was like stuff was going on there reading like hours of content. Also, she didn't, she said the, it uses a lot of electricity, but like they have to do base wide blackouts to get this fucking experiment to work, which, uh, if you're knocking out power to essentially a frontline military base with the like fate of humanity on the line yeah you need to start fucking producing some results yep do the mission only hey there we go all right so they went with the show don't tell I retract my statement that I said earlier. The Zero Zero unit? But what's that, Yuko-sensei? Is, is that the MacGuffin?
Uh, there should be no leaves on that tree because uh, that is the uh, ending CG of the Sumika route from Extra, which takes place in December. But then again, like I said, ooh, that, that tree rustle, ooh. As I was saying, winter in Japan, it's weird in some spots. Like down, where does this take place? Yokohama, I think? That's like, that's like just a little below Tokyo in the Kanto Plain. So it's essentially subtropical. Woo, he, you did it! After after only six episodes of people not being fully aware of the attachment of, of an entire visual novel and then the cruelty of being ripped away from that world and thrust into a place that is completely strange and alien to you where things don't make sense and people don't know you and all humanity is at danger. But six episodes... That's that's enough for us to know how important it is. All right, he also looks slightly different too. He's uh, supposed to be like pretty buff compared to his extra version self. I mean, he's right. Fuck yeah, three years. Ooh, completely like all right side audio track for that. It's almost like you have main character powers. This better be a good salute. I will be judging you on this. Okay, heels together. Okay. He kind of drew his arm up from the side a bit too much. Obviously, this fictional UN military, like, how they're supposed to do their movements is going to be slightly different, but you're kind of supposed to, like, take your fist and, like, bring it up, like, the center line of your stomach. So, like, as you're raising it, Bring it so your fist is like over your belly button and then raise it up. You just kind of brought it right up. Yes, yes, he's very cool, Yuko Sensei. Oh man, now I can finally understand what this dude is saying. It's super easy just to like drown out the noise of uh, of certain songs if you don't know the lyrics. Like, be honest, be honest. How many times have you listened to a song on the radio and you thought you knew the lyrics, but then you uh, you look at the uh, the lyrics track and you're like, oh, I've been singing completely wrong words the entire time. I'll admit it, I've done it. I can't think of any examples like right off the cuff, but. But yeah. Don't don't try to fucking hide it. I know it. I can see you. We're all human.
God, I'm so fucking tired. I had, a, I had a doctor's appointment the other day where I had to drive like an hour and a half away on in between like my night shifts. So that took like it's a three hour like round trip uh, with the extra like two hours that I was there, which brought me down to like six hours to sleep and like get up and go to work. Yep. Yep. Fictional fictional work. All characters. Totally, totally uh, fiction cannot be used whatsoever to be a parallel to real life. To da, 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 all that fun stuff. Uh, I'm rambling and uh, I don't want to make a fool of myself any more than I have. So, yeah, that's where we're going to end uh, it here for today. But if you do want to hear me make a fool of myself, uh, for whatever reason, feel free to check out any of my other videos. And, uh, you know, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And ring the notification bell for any, any other fucking dumpster fire videos I make that you want to see and point and laugh at the train wreck. But, yeah, that's where we're going to end it. And I don't know how youtube's new like dislike thumb up thumb down thing is i think it's fucking stupid like show off show off how much you dislike me if if you were gonna give this video a dislike fucking throw a comment down below and i'll pin that shit i'll pin it right to the top saying like yeah good this good viewer feedback metrics for the audience too because i guess how it is on my side if i go to like the studio I can see the actual like likes to dislike ratio with solid numbers, but eh, eh, eh. YouTube sucks. What else is new? Anyway, we're we're done. Go, go. You, well, you don't have to stay here. Well, you can't stay here. You don't have to go home. Just leave. All right. Bye.